It's uh, 4.47 in the morning, uh, June 5th to Wednesday. Uh, we're going to go to Santa Ana River Lakes for, some, for our very first catfish trip of the season. Um, we'll meet up with Jeremy at the gas station, maybe get some snacks over there. And then we'll be at the lake, so I'll see you guys over there. Hopefully we can finally cat, uh, get on some catfish today. Hopefully. I'm hoping, I'm hoping. But we're catching at least one catfish today. I'm calling it right now. One catfish. But um, yeah, hopefully it goes well. I'll see you guys over there. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Look at that wait now. I'm going to go get ice real quick. Alright. I'm going to probably gonna grab some sunflower seeds and like a breakfast sandwich or something. I'm gonna wallet. Sheesh. Put to Civics. Always looking clean. Alright, let's get out to the lake. Would you forget, Jeremy? Right away, trip day. You forgot what? <laughs> Guys? What'd you forget? Don't rely on me if I need to bring something. What'd you forget? I always bring me, myself, and I. What'd you forget? Shrimp. The shrimp. Camera on. Oh, now we gotta buy shrimp at the taco shop for, like Jeremy said, the double the price. That's crazy. Probably. Okay. Bad boy. Bad boy. Alright guys, we are out here at San Ana River Lakes, uh, right here by the El Pollo Loco side. Uh, first setup, I got a uh, two ounce coin uh, weight and then tied to a double loop uh, rig. Uh, one's gonna have mackerel, one's gonna have shrimp. Let's see if anything bites on this setup. And then the other one is going to have uh, a Carolina rig with a one ounce egg sinker bead swivel and a couple inches of leader uh, with a, a one knot uh, circle hook. Um, so let's see if we have anything. Let's see if we catch anything. Uh, Want to get these these lines out there and hope for the best. I think we might be on, guys. Yep, I think we're on. I think we're on, Jeremy. First catfish of the day or what? I think it's still biting it, that's the thing. It's a biter! biter. I think it's still biting, that's the thing. I'm not sure if it's on yet. That's crazy, bro. Dang. On a fish, how big's your hook? Like catfish big? Are you sure it's not your weight just skipping in the water? Maybe. <laughs> I stopped and it was still going. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's just That's crazy. Do you have your tongs? My tweezers? Yeah. Oh, oh yeah. I, I, yeah, I saw it get top this time. Oh uh, yeah. All right. It's been a couple of minutes already since this one hasn't been getting tapped anymore, so I'm gonna check it. I'm gonna see if maybe there's a fish on, <laughs> or if it just stole the bait that it was picking at. So let's see. Let's see, let's see. Yeah, there's nothing on it. Pretty sure. That's crazy though. Alright, let's hope the macro doesn't fall off because the other piece just fell off the hook. 
starting to get a little, a little loose in there, but I doubt the shrimp will fall off. <laughs> Let's see if the macro doesn't fall off. Oh, I fucking fell off. Are you serious right now, bro? Okay, let's try this again. So we got our macro. Gonna put our good stink, good, good sauce on here. Rub it in. Oh, fuck, that's felt so bad. I almost gagged. It's not that bad, though. Okay. Under there. Let's stretch our hands real quick. Okay. We downsized the weight to a one ounce instead of a two ounce. Let's see if that helps the bait not fly out there. Let's hope because the bait here is expensive, you guys. Don't forget your bait like Jeremy because otherwise you're going to end up spending 20 bucks on bait. What'd you forget? Don't rely on me if I need to bring something. That's probably not even gonna last the whole day here. Try not to get some again. And... Fuck. I don't trust how this macro sitting on here. Thing out there, and there you go. We might be on you guys. No, is it? I can't tell. No, nah, I don't think so. Fuck. Nah. Man, bro. Yeah, I gotta leave it alone, Jeremy. Man. On the macro again, bro. Macro's getting smacked. Yours? Yeah, I had it go. Yep. Yeah, it's getting tapped. Jeremy's getting tapped right now, too. Oh, man. All right, let's get this thing back out there. Let's see. guys so literally just sat down this one's getting bit and then this one over here is getting bit too just waiting just waiting for that hard tug on the rod and know that it's on but so far they've just been love tapping and just so oh, you hopefully we catch some fish so keep you guys posted you gotta keep watching these rods because they're both getting tapped at the same time it's crazy and they're both getting a bit on macro. This one has just macro. That one has shrimp and macro, but I think he's getting a bit on macro. And then Jeremy just got tapped right now too. And he has, um, Jeremy has macro as well on his. So let's see if we can get out some fish, you guys. It's barely seven in the morning. So we still got a good while that we're here. Look at the setup. I think Jeremy's getting a bite right now too. We got his Civic right here, we got a little canopy or chairs, and we got my Civic in the front. Sheesh. It's a pretty, pretty clean setup right now, but I don't know, I might change out my hooks. Maybe it's the hooks that are messing with us, but so far we haven't been able to land fish. But I think Jeremy is watching his rod right now, so he probably got bit pretty good. Oh man. We gotta catch some fish, man. We gotta catch some, some catfish for you guys. No bites. Nothing. 
a tank between the rebate. The red one has a fly line uh, with macro under, so maybe we could catch one like that. I'm going to switch back to the Carolina rig, but I'm going to keep taking a nap right now. I just woke up from my nap. I just finished rebating both rods now. Um, Jeremy has just checked this. He's getting bites on his, but I don't know. We can't tell if it's a catfish or if it's small bait fish just picking at our bait way far out there, but hope we hope to land one today. We hope to land one today. <sighs> but I'm on chow. Jeremy made us some spaghetti with some meat sauce and some ground beef. And right now he's about to take out the cold ones. But I'm on chow. We're still waiting for a bite. Uh, my white one just got bit, um, but man, we can't land these fish, man. Cheers, guys. Oh. Guys, it's 12:28. Uh, We've just been getting taps here and there, but man, no fish landed so far. We got about three and a half hours left, and Jeremy, I think we might leave with a skunk today. Fourth skunk in a row. That's crazy. Catfish. Cabbage season hasn't been a good start so far. I'm hoping to at least land one, bro. One each. Oh, man. Alright, guys. It's uh, 2.47 p.m. We're going to call it. Uh, the bites have been getting pretty slow. We haven't gotten much action anymore. And it's pretty hot out. Uh, it was still fun, though. We got a lot of bites in the morning. But uh, we just weren't able to land them. Um, it's a Wednesday, so it wasn't too bad uh, for a weekday. Because a lot of people like to come on the weekends, Friday, Saturdays, because they know that the lake has just been stocked. So they want a great guaranteed catch, quote unquote. But I'm pretty sure not a lot of people leave with limits on Fridays as well. Um, that's why we just come on the weekday, avoid the crowd, and still have a chance to catch fish. But each to their own. Uh, we still had a good time. Jeremy made some pretty good spaghetti. We had to, we had a couple beers. Um, we had a couple laughs here and there, spussing around, and just in hopes to maybe land a fish. But we were having fun with those bites for sure. But it's all good. We'll get them next time. I'll see you guys in the next video. Uh, maybe we'll maybe next video we'll be at Santa River Lakes again. Who knows? But I'm probably gonna stop by uh, the tackle shop right now to buy more good good sauce because. Your boy's running out of it, so we gotta restock. So if we hit Mile Square again later this month, we could use that. But uh, today, today's been today. All the rods were getting hit on macro most of the time. I, I know Jeremy has been getting hit with uh, with shrimp too, uh, with the banging shrimp, good good sauce as well. Uh, I was getting hit. Uh, we were both getting hit on the pieces of macro with uh, the good stink of good good sauce so and they were biting without the good good sauce as well so it was just more of the fish just not wanting to take the bait so uh, either way i'll catch you guys in the next video we're gonna start picking up uh, thank you guys for watching and later